J. Crew, uh, Mickey Drexler stepping down. I don't down. think anyone could really have turned around. You know, J. Crew is a, a, an apparel company in the mall, and uh, the mall is dying. Apparel's dying now. PVH has managed to transcend that, and they just won some uh, illustrious awards for Calvin Klein for their designer. But PVH's strength is inventory control at the mall and great uh, growth in Europe. Uh, J. Crew did not have that as a backdrop. And by the way, Maywell was doing quite well. I know he wasn't able to blow that out, but you know, I, I mean, I look at Mickey's situation. I say he said he was overrun by technology, and that's true. But uh, you know, uh, let's see what uh, James Brett does from from West Elm. But I think that the idea, if you go over the uh, conference calls for uh, Lululemon uh, last quarter, not this one, if you go over the last two conference calls for Urban Outfitters and you talk about fashion, I think you would understand exactly the jam that Mickey was in. I, I don't want to judge Mickey too harshly. He's one of the great merchants of our time. And I don't think that anyone can really navigate that scenario. Zara's had, uh, Identix has, some, has had some luck in fast supply chain. But look at Ralph Lauren. I mean, Ralph Lauren's a remarkable label, and that's not done well. And uh, I can just, uh, you know, I can tick off all the different apparel companies that are having trouble in the mall. Mickey was just one of them. That's all.